Safety Communications, how are you doing? Yes, no way you know you need me for the no day. Okay, no, that's 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 fine. I consent. <laughs> I don't. I, I'm perfectly fine with that. Okay, well, I just like the one they won't know. I got to tell you that the more, but you didn't understand me. No, that's fine. I, no, I, 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 I consent to being recorded. That, that's perfectly fine. Um, Carol had, uh, Carol updated me and advised that you weren't satisfied with her report. So she, I, I'm calling you back just to dialogue briefly about it. This, I think, has to do with the, um, with an element of the reported incident not having an audio record. Am I understanding that correctly? No record at all, but my investigation in the minority is the worst. I am the one that ended in that when they see, but no one ain't showing it now, and when you walk out, in the dungeon room yesterday, the very first thing you all said was hearing the video of the night, I mean the audio of the 911 of the wind they see. Alright, so, well, uh, I'm gonna, I'm gonna explain this a little bit more. Traffic accident. 
but you, Mr. Nathanson, you're calling about a shooting. Well, it doesn't have anything to do with a traffic accident. It must not be that call. And we listen to the next call. We try to find all the calls that match. What Carol and Marissa were able to find on that day in question related to specific incidents, as I understand it, because we talked about it before I called you back, they refreshed my memory, that they were able to find a call having to do with the dinner bell and a call having to do with the firefighter. But this is what I need to impress upon you. We don't show any incident on that date, on that time, involving a Winn-Dixie. Now, that doesn't mean it didn't happen. What it means is no one on any phone call that we were able to hear said anything about Winn-Dixie, said anything about the a shooting, or were linked to an incident that happened in Denellen. And that's all we can look for. Now, we went one step further because we're diligent. And I know that you're not satisfied. Carol is, Carol is um, disappointed to know that. And it's her job, really. She, all she does is, not all she does, I'm going to get in trouble if I say it that way, but her mandate, her primary function is fulfilling public records requests. That's her expertise. That's her specialty. So if there's a record, she wants to release it. We have no reason not to release it, but all we can do is try to find it. So we went one step further because when we can't find a recording, we said, well, there, if there was an incident, maybe there's a telephone number on that incident. Now, Mr. Mason, I'm going to say, when I talk about an incident, when someone calls 911 and they say, I'm at this address, maybe they say Winn-Dixie, and, and we ask them their telephone number, and they say, my telephone number is 465 all right. Now, if we can't find an incident by listening to the call that happened at that Winn-Dixie, what we then do is we'll look for a call that has to do with the incident. Well, so oh, in Denellen, there was a shooting. It didn't say Winn-Dixie. It said Blockbuster, but that Blockbuster is in the same, in the same shopping center. All right, well, let's put that call. We'll do it. We'll the number. I understand. I understand exactly what you're saying to me, so... I don't mean to stop you. I'm not yeah, trying to I be rude. Lot, you have to interrupt, because I'll keep going. So. I don't. Um, I'm not trying to be rude to you. But you gotta remember in December, I ate when I was talking, I ate. And you, you both turned around and said, the when they see it being investigated at this time, this is why I cannot get the 911. Information. Okay. So and that is, that is on video uh, so coming out of your mouth. So, we're talking in December. There was, there was a, there was a portion of the requested record that couldn't be released because it was being investigated. Um, well, that's the one I want. understand it. Now, because I just followed up with Carol and Marissa, that was the firefighter call that we just recently gave you. If, if someone said, myself included, because, again, I just I want to be completely transparent with you. I know that there was a Winn-Dixie. I know there was a dinner bell. I know there was a firefighter. I know that there were three records requests. I'm not directly involved in pulling them, but I know just to identify with you, that's what you're looking for, and we and stop looking. I agree with you. I appreciate you. I misspoke. That, that's my apologies, and I, and I accept responsibility for that. But I can assure you, Carol is not holding any records back. Uh, it, even if, and here's an example. If I, was, I don't need a know. I don't need an example of the years old. I know how white is. People make mistakes. I understand that. But this has been going on now for over seven months of um, me asking, I me I asking I for something. If you don't care for one, it's, a lot of what we do is, is um, yeah, and I'm sure you understand it more than most people do, but it, it, I, I tend to break into examples just to kind of acquaint people. Oh, I, I'm, not I'm not trying to disrespect you, sir. I'm not trying to disrespect you, but I understand. What your job is, I'm not the new your job, I'm just the new what I got on video and what you said yesterday and that is on video too. Okay. 
Well, and so can you re can you refresh my memory on what I said on video yesterday? Here is the with the D911 audio you reloaded. I'm sorry, say that one more time. So I heard 911 audio. Here is the with the D911 you reloaded. It's on audio. It's what you said and what the lady said. Okay. Well, so the, it, I, I'm not refuting that. So what I was doing, just to, if, if, I, I don't want to, it's not an example, it's my explanation, is to my recollection, your request had to do with a variety of different moments on that day and locations. What was well, now, I'm now I'm now we going to rub you again. When I said when Dixie, because I, for me, the dinner bell that with Dixie element is we furnish every element and I look at your entire request in totality, for me, internally. And the wing they need. And the wing they need. And requested information on the date and time. I'll do. I'll do. Dinner bell and a firefighter. Which of those you, we have access to, it's the sum of all of them. To me, I classify them all as one large incident. But that's my internal metric. That wasn't meant to mislead you. And I apologize if I miscommunicated. But I, I didn't mean to. In, I didn't mean to suggest that it is definitively the Win Dixie because if we had the recording, we would release it. Well, so yeah, I, I apologize for that. The, you have to remember the Win Dixie would be an hour after the dinner bell. So, I'm say that again. The Win Dixie happened within an hour of the dinner bell. Yes, and then I called like three more hours later that night. Because I, I did not know I had the shooter on video until I got home. And when I got home, I looked at my video, and that's where I realized I shot the shooter on video. And that's why, that's when I went to Dun Allen, and I ordered a gun, I mean I ordered a mine, and they called 911 for me. And that's when the marine officer came out. So there's a more hour difference there. Okay, so Mr. I don't want to frustrate you. So, um, um, can you, um, I want to understand everything. Would you break that up into a smaller part just to make certain I'm understanding you? Because I missed some of that. Okay. So what I gathered was that there was, um, I, I lost you when you said you dropped. If I if I heard you correctly, I thought you said you dropped something. No, I said okay. it was the dinner bell, and within the hour, and when the I got it up. So uh, the dinner bell, the Win Dixie. What was the last part? I said within the hour. It was the dinner bell, okay. and then I got ya there, and then when the I got there, but I didn't remember it until almost 9 o'clock at night, because I, I wanted to make sure I had it on video, which I did, and that's when I gave it to the marine officer, I gave the video to the marine officer on his phone. Okay. Okay, and I heard, so you gave it to the video of the police officer on the phone, oh, that's fine. But that was, that, that was my like good, my dirty at night, my hours later. What happened five hours later? My phone home of the fire department was more five hours after the bad of the dinner bell and the wind disease. Okay, I'm following you. Go ahead. So the fire department hours after the dinner bell in the Win Dixie, I'm following you. No, no, Win Dixie, you be within the hour of the dinner bell. Okay, got it. Following. And that's where a night and you turned around and said back in December that.